Welcome back everybody, today we're here to talk about The Walking Dead Season 10 Finale in Comic Con and I wanted to make this update video to, to do like a bit of a preview for Comic Con because it's in a couple days, it's, it's in the 24th so very shortly we're going to be having Comic Con and uh, we're going to be learning a lot there. Obviously on the channel I'll be covering everything we learned there about the Season 10 Finale, possibly Season 11, uh, Fear the Walking Dead, The World Beyond and hopefully some Rick Grimes news. So again, I'll be covering everything on the channel and today I want to do a bit of a preview to talk about everything that we can possibly learn. Also, I'll be doing a Q&A the next day or two leading up to Comic Con. There's a post in the community section of my channel. I know a lot of you have already left some questions. Uh, I'll be answering those uh, in the next day or two again. So if you would do want to leave a question, feel free uh, to comment one in the community section. But with all that being said, let's get into it. So yeah, Comic Con is on the 24th. Uh, we are going to be learning uh it's it's it was marketed as like a season 10 finale uh but hopefully we learn some season 11 stuff i know i made a video earlier talking about uh some season 11 news we just got about the casting for uh, uh stephanie which is really awesome so obviously season 11 is already underway um they can be filming because of everything that's going on but they're still writing the season as usual and i'm sure they have things planned out you know casting i'm sure they can work on remotely it's just that they can't can be filming so we probably we know we're not going to be getting any um you know footage from season 11 but i do expect some sort of news um not too much though because we haven't seen the finale yet because um you know they wouldn't want to spoil what's going to happen in the finale now the finale is going to be a big thing now one thing we know we're going to learn at comic con is we're going to be getting the air date that's the first thing i want to talk about because angela king did say that we will learn they're going to announce the air date at the virtual comic-con um and again i, I don't th i don't know if i specified this earlier but it's like a virtual comic-con it's going to be like online uh but yeah angela kang did say that they're going to announce the air date so that kind of tells us that if they're going to announce the air date that probably means they have the episode ready so again it's going to be on the 24th which is a friday so the only remaining sunday on july would be the 26th now i know everyone would love it if it's going to come out on the 26th um but I just don't know. Um, it's hard to say because I, ha I mean, it's hard to say um, when it's going to come out with everything going on. But I just have this feeling that if they're going to announce it, I'm sure they're going to have the episode ready, right? Like, why would they announce an air date if the episode isn't ready? Because who knows, you know, maybe things, maybe they couldn't finish the episode again or something happens, you know. So there's no reason to announce it if they're not ready with the episode. So that's why I kind of think the episode is ready to go. Um, so I think it'll be awesome if it comes out on the 26th, which would only be two days later. So I don't know if they would do that. Uh, but I'm thinking sometime in August. I really am. Um, and I think Fear the Walking Dead Season 6 will also be in August. But we'll see. Um, but the first thing I want to talk about is who we can expect to be at Comic-Con. So, uh, this is the preview. I know I talked about this in a separate, in a different video, but I just wanted to make this, uh, everything we know video, um, for, uh, leading up to Comic-Con. So again, Friday, July 24th, that's 4 p.m. Eastern time, 1 p.m. Pacific time. The panelists will be Scott M. Gimple, Angela Kang, Greg Nicotero, Norman Reedus, Melissa McBride, Jeffrey Dean Morgan, Lauren Cohan, Josh McDermott, Seth Gilliam, Ross Marquand, Carrie Payton, and Paolo Lazaro. So that's really awesome. Obviously, Maggie's coming back, so Lauren Cohan is going to be there. And the moderator is going to be Chris Hardwick. Um, as usual and then also Seth Gilliam this is really interesting because Seth Gilliam who plays Father Gabriel I don't think I've ever seen him at a comic-con panel which is this I mean unless I'm mistaken but I don't really remember him at being at one of the comic-con panels now the reason I'm bringing this up is because if you've been watching my videos I know I've been saying that they're putting a lot of focus on Father Gabriel which kind of makes me worry like in the trailer um, and in the, specifically the opening minutes um, he's like pretty much leading the group, you know, he's like telling everybody what to do, he's saying the plan, and like Daryl's there too, and Carol's there, but it's Father Gabriel who's making the plan, so there's a lot of focus on him, it kind of reminds me a little bit of Carl, when uh, his final episode, you know, when the Saviors attacked, he was taking leadership, and he was helping everybody, and then we saw what happened to him, so, well, actually, I mean, he already got bent earlier, so that's different, um, but you get the point, you know, there was a lot of focus on him, and that tends to happen on The Walking Dead, when there's a character who's probably gonna die or leave, there's a lot of focus on that character, um, now, I might just be reading too, into this too much, but I don't know, um, we'll see, I mean, 
I know earlier there was an interview. Uh, uh, I think it was with Angela Kang. And she said there's a lot of awesome stuff coming up with Father Gabriel. So I don't know if she would say that and then Father Gabriel dies. But again, maybe she's just throwing us off. But we'll see. Let me know what you think about that. If you think Father Gabriel will make it out of this one. I hope he does. I really like TV show Father Gabriel. I think South Gilliam is really cool. Um, and yeah, I mean, I would love for them to keep Father Gabriel. But again, we'll see. I mean, the character development for him is also really good. Like seeing him from the beginning till now, like it's awesome. So I'd love to see him stick around. But again, you know it's pretty unpredictable what's going to happen because it seems like they've pretty much changed up like who's going to die in the whisper arc you know from the pikes to sadiq like everything was different so anything could happen but again let me know what you think so i'm assuming we're probably going to get like a trailer or something which is also um why i'm thinking that maybe they would want to hold off um and not like release it the two sundays after like if they i mean if they they might do like a trailer right on the 24th and then they might like uh, wait and you know release it on the on the second of August, which is the next Sunday. Um, but at the same time, you know you can make the argument that uh, you know fans have been waiting for four months for this episode or three months uh, for the episode, and they just might as well just release it. You know, talk about it on Friday and then release it on the Sunday. Um, but again, if they're doing like a full on Comic Con panel about it. Maybe they want to hold it off a little bit. Maybe they want to give us a trailer to get us excited for it and to get the word around that The Walking Dead is back and then everyone can watch the finale and maybe a couple weeks after that. So anything could really happen. Um, you know, I mean, I don't, I'm, I'm not like, I mean, I wouldn't like mind it if it's a little bit later, if they give us like a trailer and stuff like that. But, but I think it'll be awesome if it's in the 26th, you know, like two days. Imagine that, like they just say like, okay, you guys can watch it in two days. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. Uh, but let me know what you think and when you think the episode's going to air. And then we also will probably get some sort of season 11 news. Um, we, I know we just got the casting news yesterday, but they're probably going to talk a little bit about the Commonwealth, maybe. I think they um, I think they might, you know, um, I'm sure fans are going to ask. I, I don't know how that's going to work with the virtual Comic-Con if people are going to. I think people will send in questions like uh, via the Internet. Um, so hopefully they give us some sort of information about um, the Commonwealth, but Scott M. Gimple is also there, so hopefully we can get some Ray Grimes news. I made a video talking about the the recent Ray Grimes news we got uh, from David Albert, saying that they're pretty much ready to start filming. They're just waiting for it to be, you know, uh, to for it to be safe again to start filming. So I know last Comic Con we got like a teaser trailer for the Ray Grimes movie, so I don't know if we're gonna get like another one. I think it'll be pretty cool. Um, but I'm expecting us to get some sort of rig news from Scott M. Gimple. All right, so next we got Fear the Walking Dead. Uh, we got uh, Fear the Walking Dead. We got Scott M. Gimple, Andrew Chambliss, and Ian Goldberg, Lenny James, Alicia Devon Carey, Coleman Domingo, Denai Garcia, Karen David, Jenna Alfman, and Ruben Blades. Again, moderated by Chris Hardwick. That's going to be uh, 3 p.m. Eastern Time, so 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So that's going to be like right. It's, it's going to be Fear, and then The Walking Dead, and then The World Beyond. Um, so again, uh, Lenny James is going to be there. Uh, so we don't remember it's a cliffhanger with him too. We don't know what's going to happen with, Len with Morgan. So, I mean, Lenny James is there, so it's going to be interesting to see if they say like he's going to stick around. I think he said Lenny James directed an episode of Fear the Walking Dead. So he's going to be there, I think, regardless of his, of his involvement on Fear the Walking Dead. Um, but we'll see if they throw that question at him, like, is Morgan alive? I have a feeling he will be alive. I don't know if they would kill Morgan. Like, would they kill Morgan on Fear the Walking Dead? You know, especially after he started it on The Walking Dead. Let me know what you think about that in the comments down below. I think he's going to be alive, but let me know what you guys think. Also, if they're going to give us an air date for the Season 10 finale, I'm assuming they will give us an air date for Fear the Walking Dead. I'm only assuming that, though, because uh, I think it did say... Um, they stopped production on Fear the Walking Dead because of the coronavirus. So they're, they are, I don't even think they're done filming, unless I'm wrong, but that's what I read. Um, I don't think they're even done filming Fear the Walking Dead, so maybe they won't even give us a release date on that. Uh, but I do remember earlier in the uh, spring, someone said, I think it was Denai Garcia, she had an interview saying that we probably will see Season 6 in August, which would line up with, um, with the Season 10 finale, because if they release the Season 10 finale in August... And then seasons, uh, season six, um, you know, right afterwards, it will work out. And then they would save the world beyond for, 
you know the fall or winter all right and speaking of uh world beyond uh that's up next at 2 p.m pacific time 5 p.m eastern we got scott m gimple matt negret which i'm very excited for because he co-created the show with scott m gimple and i was looking at the episodes that matt has written for the walking dead he's been a writer on the walking dead for a while and it's uh it's been some really good episodes i'm excited for this alaya royale alexa mincer hal compson nicholas Cantu, nico tortello and at Mahindru, Julia Orman, and Joe Holt. Sorry, I'm so bad with these names. I still got to learn the new names for The Walking Dead. Um, and then again, moderated by Chris Hardwick. So I'm very excited about this one because, uh, I mean, I know they gave us two trailers already, but I'm excited because The World Beyond is only going to be two seasons long. Um, I kind of keep forgetting about that, but it's only going to be two seasons long. It's not going to be like The Walking Dead or Fear of the Walking Dead. It's only going to be two, t so 20 episodes total, I think. Which is like what, like four more episodes in a regular season of The Walking Dead and a regular season of Fear the Walking Dead, you know? So that's that's kind of interesting because so that kind of tells us that this has a specific purpose in the bigger picture of The Walking Dead. Like this is something like it's not like just like another show that they want to milk out. I don't think so. I think if they wanted to do that, they would run for longer seasons. This is only going to be two seasons long, so it's going to be interesting to see like how this relates to you know, the walking dead, fear the walking dead. And I think, um, you know, the, the most importantly, the Rick Grimes movies, which I think this will connect to that because of the CRM and the helicopter and all that kind of stuff. You know, we didn't learn too much about the CRM on fear the walking dead. We didn't learn too much about it on the walking dead. Um, we might with the Commonwealth, but I don't know, but this looks to be the show that we're going to learn the most about them, which is why I think like the, the specific purpose of this show is to, you know, teach us about the, uh, CRM and, you know, um, hype us up for the walking or get us ready for the walking dead and hype us up, you know? So I'm not sure if we're going to get like a specific air date for this one. We might. Um, but again, I feel like, uh, I, I don't know how I, I know they're done filming with this one. I don't know how far along they are in the post-production. So maybe we get an air date, but we'll see. And maybe this one comes out before fear the walking dead. If fear the walking dead is not done filming. Um, but yeah, it looks like we will be getting some air dates, uh, some trailers, probably a trailer for each one of these. And then, um, hopefully some Rick Grimes news. Um, and season 11 news so there you guys go i wanted to make this uh, video right before comic-con uh just so everyone can know what we can expect again i'll be making videos talking about everything we learn at comic-con so be sure to stay tuned by hitting that subscribe button i am gonna wrap it up there for this video so hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did be sure to leave a like rating for more walking the videos be sure to subscribe and as always thanks for watching please stay safe everybody and i'll see you guys soon